Hi, welcome to today's Talk of the Town. I'm Sandy Benson. Because feeling good about yourself is very important during any life-altering illness, joining us now, wig specialist Debbie Price conveys how Burke's Pharmacy, the wig room, shares in the indomitable spirit in women that will not allow us to quit and their, commu their commitment to participate in our wellness. Welcome to the show, Debbie. Hi, thank you, thank you. Thank so how did you get started in this business? Well, it actually happened about, um, about in 2008. I was reading an article in Guidepost magazine. I don't know whether you're familiar with that or not. But there was an article in there about a lady in North Carolina that had a wig shop. And what she did is she helped women going through chemotherapy. Well, I was so intrigued by it, I couldn't get out of my mind. Mm -hmm. So I finally said, I, I have to call her. So I called her. Her name was Darlene, and we're friends to this day. Mm -hmm. um, uh, she said, come on down. Mm -hmm. So I got on a plane. I went down to North Carolina. I worked in her store with her for a few days, and we talked for a few days. And um, I came back up to Pennsylvania because I was living in Pennsylvania right. at that time. And I got a storefront. I got everything done. I got everything together, you know, all the accessories, everything I needed. And in four months, I had my own store open. Wow. And I'm telling you, I think it was something I was really meant to be. Wow. I, I felt think it's wonderful. Like it was. It really it was touched me. you. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. And so, what brought you to the Low Country and Burke's Pharmacy? Well, it was actually my children. Okay. <laughs> Kids, huh? Kids. <laughs> so, after six years mm -hmm. of working six days a week mm -hmm. in the store, and mm -hmm. it was a very successful business, right. um, we grew and grew. Um, I just decided after my last child came down, they all came down to schools here. Mm -hmm. And uh, we vacationed here every year in Hilton Head for many, many years. Mm -hmm. So this was always like our second home. Right. Well, when they started going to school, it was College of Charleston, University of South Carolina. Everybody headed down. So, you know, the last one came down and I said, what just am, made I, it, yeah, what am just, I doing? You yeah, know? I just made it easy yeah, decision, right? Yeah, so I sold the business and... Um, I moved down here in July, mm -hmm. and I actually um, approached Burke's Pharmacy when I got down here to see if they would be interested mm -hmm. in doing wigs. Right. And they said, well, we would, but we've never really had anyone to do it. And um, I said, well, now you do. Yeah. So we got everything, you know, we came up with a plan, you know, and uh, decided to move forward on it. And so um, I, we see a few samples here, but tell mm -hmm. us a little bit about the wigs, different styles, colors, items available that you carry. Well, we, we carry um, all kinds of styles and colors. They're, they're synthetics, mm -hmm. but you can get human hair. Okay. Okay, they, the wig companies of today are so much better than they were in other times. The, the hair is much lighter, the caps of it are much lighter, they're not heavy on your well, head. It just looks natural. They look, these are synthetics. Yeah, they're, they're fabulous. Yeah, they're these beautiful. Are they are really beautiful. So yeah. how, uh, how is um, uh, the Burke's Pharmacy in your wig room there? Well, we have, what we did was I share the room with a girl who does the post mastectomy mm -hmm. bra, mm -hmm. bras also. So when we went in there, um, there's a room, there's a private room, and we put, we made it together like a little boutique. Right. We, we re revamped it and made it like I have a chair, you know, mm -hmm. a, a, a beauty chair in there. And, um, and then the other side, she has all the wig, I mean, all the, uh, the bras. Right. And um, so we share the room different days right. um, and it just works. I mean, she's yes. a lovely, she's a lovely girl too. And we just work together and, you right. know, just love working and you're doing with the such ladies. A, I mean, really you're empowering women, yeah. which is just, yeah. a, uh, just yeah. a gift. And I also, I also have scarves wig products, I also have scarves and head wraps. Yes. So when you're going through chemotherapy, you right. need to really look nice. You need to look good. To because, feel good. Right. And so I have all the products that, that do that. And so uh, tell us about the ladies who come to you and use your services. Um, well, it's anyone can come in and get a wig um, just for a new look, if you'd right. like. My, our main focus is on the ladies who are going through uh, chemotherapy or, uh, or thinning hair. Thinning right. hair is a is such yeah, a big a is. big problem, bigger than you than yes. you think. Yes. So we cater to those people, and um, you know we want them to look good. When you're going through chemo, you want to look good right. because when you look good, you concentrate on other things of your wellness. Right. Y you you don't worry about your hair. You concentrate on everything else because there's there's so much worry. There's so much Certainly. to think about. Certainly. So and when you look good, again. 
Yes. You always feel yes, good. Yes, absolutely. And, and it just takes that pressure off of you. Debbie, thank you for yeah. what you're doing here, mm -hmm. and, and um, I'm sur sur certain that there are um, women are just very thankful to have this now in the area. Mm -hmm. We will have all of Burke's um, pharmacy information on the screen, and we thank you so much for joining us today. Oh, well, thank you so much. It was a pleasure. And we'll be right back with Talk of the Town.